What's going on guys, it's Dichronic here and I wanted to show you something really really special today It's the customizable races and team deathmatches today that was released in GTA 5 online and uh, GTA 5 normal It is the patch of 1.07 that allowed Rockstar uh, creator users I am pretty sure that you have to have a Rockstar account on Social Club to be able to start making these maps And uh, then you can start making them. It's really really cool. I've tried out the races I haven't done the team deathmatches but basically you gotta make a name, description, you can make your title photo, you can put down props such as benches, you can put down the starting line, you can see awesome cars like in the whole thing. I made it so it's a motorcycle, like stunt obstacle course map that I was doing where I, I had cool things, you had to ramp off the bench and go over the house and go around this area where Michael's house is and I, I, I had a lot of fun, you can see here, bouncing off the bench and everything. I really like doing strategy courses and I hope I can make a whole bunch more for you guys. Let me know what you think of this map actually, I have published it. Uh, there are a few glitches I have found already of uh, where the spawning is pretty bad, but I really really like this. You can also go into a certain, you can actually place down things while you're in your bike mode, which can make it easier to just quickly uh, select props and do whatever you want. And I think that's really cool. You can actually switch between them by hitting uh, select or back on the Xbox controller uh, while you're in just a uh, main menu, like uh, not this menu, but uh, the menu from before is where you have to actually switch things up. And you can set uh, as many checkpoints as you want. I think they limit it so you have to have it more than uh, 0.62 miles is what they recommend. I'm not sure if it's a requirement. And yeah, I'm just putting like checkpoints up on top of things so you have to jump over them and get like epic air and I do ramps and and, and over houses and and uh, you actually use your, uh, I think I used Michael only because I was in uh, this solo game beforehand uh, and that's the only reason I can think of and you probably can use uh, your online character when you're testing it. Also, this is a stunt jump thing where you can actually create your own stunt jumps with a cinematic camera. Uh, it didn't work very well when I did it, but that's actually an option for you. And uh, this is kind of the finished course of my map that I made. It is called Jump, and the description is Parkour. It made by Dichronic, of course. That's me. Uh, you can check it out on the Rockstar things. I'm not totally sure how you do it. I know how you can host your own game after you create it a map but uh, as it goes for other people there's not enough on the list yet for people to actually choose from but if you're able to choose mine mine is called jump and it is a parkour map jumping over buildings and doing all sorts of cool things uh, around the map uh, let me know what you guys think I'm thinking about starting up a whole bunch of like series of races team deathmatch things I'm not totally sure uh, how cool the making of those maps are. I think I can make something really cool. This was just like making ramps and all this stuff. I can think about making a bunch of decor and, and awesome things in the map. And uh, you guys, let me know what you think. Uh, you want me to make more strategy courses, that would be freaking awesome. And uh, I'd love to uh, see, see me do them. Anyways, uh, you can actually publish it, like I said. And to get to them, you just go to online, uh, to jobs, and then you go to my jobs. And it should be under the races. And uh, that's basically how you get to them, and it's really simple. I hope you guys enjoyed, and let me know any questions you have down in the comments below.